So I was recently going through my notes and I found out that I had a Spider-Man Tobey Maguire fan series that I was working on, basically taking different clips from, you know, Kristen Dunst movies, James Franco movies, and like Tobey Maguire's movies to make a whole new series. Well, I never had really finished it, but I did at one point actually start it. Now, it actually has a really decent concept. It basically starts from the beginning to like, you know, Peter Parker's life, you know, before and after No Way Home. Uh, I think that is really a cool concept to combine. I just never had the time to like actually edit it and like fully make it into a thing. So let's talk about it in today's video. Also, interestingly enough, I was going through the side notes, like I had side notes in the notes, uh, basically saying that the video title was asking AI to write me a Spider-Man Tobey Maguire fan series. So I imagine a lot of this came through AI and my brain. Now, for this storyline, I kind of thought it'd be interesting to see Peter Parker finally meet his younger sister, Tessa Parker. You know, I just think it would be an interesting dynamic and, you know, so I picked McKenna Grace, you know, because she's been in Marvel before as young Captain Marvel, and I'm also just 99% sure that I'm just really crushing hard on McKenna Grace. A few minutes later... Yes! 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 No! 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 Now, I just also genuinely think it just works really well with her already being kind of familiar with Marvel, and I think for some reason, like, if her and Toby had to, like, be on-screen siblings, it just would work, I guess. I don't know. Something just tells me after I post this video, I'm just going to get tagged in the most random McKenna Grace edits, and people are just going to just start annoying me. Please don't. Literally, please don't. Okay, uh, I think we're getting a little sidetracked. Let's move on. Now, I did do an intro for the series. Now, I don't think it's bad, but uh, definitely I don't think my best work, but here's a look at it. So apparently this show was supposed to go for nine seasons. Nine seasons. What in the world was I going to be doing? Was it just going to be making these through the rest of my life? Yeah, no. Now, supposedly, a little bit of context before I show you a clip. Um, Peter came home drunk one night and Teresa saw Peter, like, destroying the entire house. And, yeah, that's about it. You know what I did to get back to you? Do what I did! Sure, it's nothing Marvel would make, but still, I think it's definitely really, really good. Well, I do actually have one more clip I can show you. It's literally not that special. What are you doing here? This is Bradley. Now, um, this series, the season finale, would have had Peter fight the Sinister Six. And, yeah, I think if this, like, I don't know if this fan series was supposed to be, like, directly to the movie or something, like, based off of it, because I don't know how that works, since Doc Ock died, Sandman died, Green Goblin died, but I also think this would have changed, like, the way the villains would have died since, you know, Noah Helm and stuff, so I think this would have still happened. We were even apparently supposed to get a origin story between Peter and Harry. Now, uh, I don't, at this point, I probably won't do it. Like, there's just not a way I really could. Now, I'm sure I could. I mean, you kind of saw with the first clip of what I did. I just, it is a lot of work, especially doing it by myself, and there's other projects I want to focus on. But, uh, yeah, that's about pretty much it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.